Hey everybody, I'm Dr. Josh with Be Well Chiropractic, and I just wanted to share with you today, um, or let Alyssa yep. share today, an awesome uh, story. So I'm gonna let Alyssa kind of give a little bit um, of the history and kind of tell a little bit what's going on, why you uh, originally came in to see us. Well, you guys had an open house, and so we decided we'd come by and check it out. I didn't even actually know that this awesome place was here. So my daughter is seven, and she, um, we're having a lot of issues. So behavior issue, focus issues, um, mood, sleeping, uh, sick all the time. Mm -hmm. So there was a whole variety of issues. And I spoke to you that night mm -hmm. and you said, you know, we can help her. Yeah. So I just decided I was gonna give it a try and uh, it was the best thing that I've ever done. So within the first week, um, she slept through the night amazing yeah. we cry right now yeah. she slept through the night and that was I mean, like the first time the first week in her whole yeah. life but yeah she, no she slept. I, I mean even as a baby she would never sleep through the night mm -hmm. i mean she constantly three or four or five times a night she would be awake so she wasn't getting sleep that she needed sure. um so you know also helped her mood because she's grumpy because she's tired so I'm tired and grumpy because she's, you know, in bed kicking me. So, mm -hmm, exactly. so, um, you yeah. know, if that right there was amazing for me to have her sleep the night. I mean, yeah, just how much that just helps the whole family dynamic, right? Yeah, just, I mean, first time in her entire life. I mean, it's amazing. Yeah. Very chronic sick all the time. Um, stomach aches every day, chronic stomach aches. I mean, nonstop, ever since she was a baby. Well, I mean, yeah. throwing up all the time. I mean, anytime we're in the car, she's throwing up. Mm -hmm. We actually went to Homer um, over spring break. I took it down and dropped her off, and she stayed with my oldest daughter. And uh, she did not throw up for the first time in the car wow. um, on the trip that down. Was awesome. So I mean, that great. she was a little bit nauseous, but still right. she didn't throw up. Yeah. So I mean, there's there's life changing things that have happened yeah. since yeah. we've been coming. Um, like I said, the chronic stomach aches. She wouldn't eat anything. She was never hungry. I mean, I have to admit it as a mom. You know, I'm like trying to get her to eat. Sure. You know, here, yeah. have ice cream for breakfast. Do I don't care. Can. Just eat yeah. something. And she's like, you know, she does have stomach aches. She doesn't feel good. She wouldn't eat. Now, I mean, she has carrot sticks at lunch. <laughs> sticks yes. lunch. Like, she eats a lot. She's gained weight for the first time. So, um, it's just, I mean, right yeah, there. And she constantly yeah. says, I'm hungry. I'm like, what? <laughs> you know, and sits down and eats a plate of food. She never ate a plate of food. I mean, she didn't bite oh, wow. here or bite there. Once in a while, if she was starving, she'd eat a hot dog, but it was pretty rare. I mean, now she'll have a hot dog and chips and, you know, I mean, you name it, she'll yeah. eat a plate of food. <laughs> That's crazy. So, it's, I mean, things like this for me. Mm -hmm. When she was a baby, you know, those tiny little baby jars, the little bitty ones, she would never even finish one of those. Wow. Ever. She wow. wouldn't eat it. And, and she could be a year old and she still wouldn't eat one of them. I mean, she just, I think, had such chronic pain in her stomach that she couldn't eat. But, you know, and I'd always take her to the doctors and we'd always do stuff, but nothing would even help her. Mm -hmm. And then within a week's time of just coming here, I mean, she's eating and she's hungry, she's sleeping. Yeah. I mean, these things are huge. She was either had diarrhea or constipation all the time. Yeah. I mean, ever since she was a baby, mm -hmm. it's one or the other. I mean, you know, as a baby, she's screaming and crying and I'd give her prune juice because, you know, she's bleeding and because she's so constipated. You know, or the opposite side, as she got older, she'd have diarrhea all the time. Yeah. I mean, constantly interrupting her schoolwork, interrupting everything, and now, I mean, she's been great. I <laughs> ask her every day, and she's, oh, my poop, I'm fine. Like, yeah, and she's excited about great. it, because yeah. we Can actually imagine? have a thing of prunes that are just sitting there on the counter, wow. and a jar we've just, had forever, and she knows, Mom, I need prune. None. That's, yeah, that's I mean, great. These are huge, those, those are huge, huge things. I mean, her focus in school has gotten so much better. Probably 50, 60 percent better than it was. Her teacher even said, "You know, what are you guys doing with Emma? Like she's doing really good." I mean, a lot of these things are life changing really for is, her yeah. and for me because you know you're constantly worried as mom and you're constantly, yeah. you know, it's it's hard when you're trying to do everything you possibly can to kind of help her out, right? And you just a lot of people just don't know, and um, yeah, and so I'm just gonna go. This little review systems here, almost every box is checked off on it. Um, and I know just from talking with her that we can almost uncheck half of those boxes already. It's only been six weeks under care. Um, I see her coming in every day. She's super happy. She runs, she jumps up on my table. Here. She loves um, it here. 
and yeah, so she, I, I just see her, uh, the changes in her, uh, just for the few minutes that I get to see her, and it's just, it's awesome, and just hearing, hearing yeah. the stories from you every day, you're always telling me something new. Yeah. And so it, well, I mean, it's, it happened a lot faster than I thought it did. I mean, I thought it would, I should say. Um, you know, I figured, okay, well, you know, it's going to take a while, it's going to take weeks or months, you know, to see a change. I mean, literally, just in that first week, you know, the sleep and appetite, and then yeah. after that, you know, came her not having stomach aches, and, you know, I mean, it's just, it's really been amazing. I mean, it's very amazing. Yeah, here. And we, so, you know, like, we still have a little bit more work to do, and we're going to keep going on, and but we're having, you know, awesome results, and um, I just want to thank you for sharing your story to let other uh, parents know out there that there, you know, there is hope and that, um, you know, you, you don't always have to go to medications and things like that to try to stop all this stuff. Or, or if, even if you just are wondering, you know, if this could help, uh, you know, my child with any of these types of issues, you know, uh, we'd, you know, we'd love to talk to you about it and see what we can do for you as well. Yep. Um, I mean, it's amazing. I can't, I tell yeah. everybody now that I, you know, I'm like, oh. I saw somebody and their kids were like, oh, and I could tell the look on their face. And mm -hmm. I said, you know, yeah. <laughs> this is what you need to go into. Exactly. You're like, I was just because there. Because I'm like, yeah. Yeah. I was like, you know, this was <laughs> me, you know, a few weeks ago, you know, with my daughter. And, you know, you just have to go try it because it's it's amazing. We just got to take the leap of faith and we need to do everything that we can for our children. Mm -hmm. um, you know, yeah. and if I would have met you guys years ago when she was a baby and brought her in, she wouldn't have had all these years of stomach aches and, you know, not feeling good. She was constantly sick. She always had a runny nose. She was constantly getting COVID. I mean, she was sick more than she was healthy. And yeah. now, we, I haven't given her allergy medicine forever. That's great. I just put you into it because I don't want her to have extra medication they don't need. Sure. She doesn't have to run her nose at all anymore. Mm -hmm. I mean, I mean, these have been huge, huge changes. Yeah. You know, it's such like six weeks is not that long. No, that's you know, and long. what I like to say is she loves coming back. She's so comfortable in this office and with you, <laughs> you know, and she goes, Oh, can you bring Dr. Dawson? She's like super excited to spring break. <laughs> She's like, Oh, you guys are Dr. Dawson. Yeah. It's like, hey, maybe you'll like it. She goes, <laughs> <laughs> which is funny, but yeah. she, you know, it makes her feel better. Yeah. So yeah, she I've likes that. coming yeah. in there. So that makes face. it easier too. It's not like you're taking her someplace and they're like, oh, I don't want to go. Sure. No, she's like jumps in there, and you know, she yeah, just jumps right on the there. table, and she's she all ready to go. She's got some funny ears or some kind of ears on uh, every time. I love that. Yeah. So, so yeah. she's. Um, I mean, it's been a wonderful experience, yeah. and you know, I hope more parents come and yeah, you know, get the treatments for right, their yeah. kids because it's with, amazing. With you know, sharing your, sharing your story, and you know, amazing. others others will hear it, you know, and hopefully we can help uh, many more kids. So, again, change the parents' lives because yeah, she's really sleeping does. through the night. She's eating. It's like <laughs> the stress level for me is like, phew, yeah, you know, so much lower yes. than it was before. Yeah, I can tell from one yeah. your face too. When you yeah. come in, that you're not as like, oh, stressed. Yay. <laughs> yeah, so that's great. Again, uh, thank you very much for your time and sharing your story. This is awesome. No problem. All right, thank you, thank and until um, next time, be well.